salvation. Mm -hmm. uh, I was brought up uh, in a grill family. Mm -hmm. I found my father playing on the instrument. Mm -hmm. uh, my mother was also helping him okay. on the choral songs. Mm -hmm. okay. So it's, it was in the blood for quite a long time. Mm -hmm. um, at the age of five, six, hence I found the instrument. Mm -hmm. I was introduced to it, mm -hmm. just like that. Okay. Well, my father was just uh, was was even using the instrument okay. um, as a form of punishment. Like if I did anything wrong, mm -hmm. okay. he was confining me to a corner of his room. Mm -hmm. You have to master this tune wow. before I let you go <laughs> and play with your friends. So, in in sense, he was um, teaching you indirectly. He was teaching me indirectly mm -hmm. in psychology what we call the intrinsic and extrinsic method of motivation. Of course. Right. Uh, so he motivated me to, to learn from, mm -hmm. the, from the instrument. Mm -hmm. And, um, well, I almost left it mm -hmm. when I was taking the school because mm -hmm. that was a difficult career. Mm -hmm. okay. The Kora to is... Which school was it? Which school? Uh, in Yamil Dankungu. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, from Dankungu, after six years, mm -hmm. Then I sat for the entrance examination. Okay. I was to go to Armitage, mm -hmm. but I think that was a mark okay. below the. Below yeah, below the, the okay. Yeah. So Mr. Kamabaji did did a talk of war. Mm -hmm. In fact, to snatch me before mm -hmm. even the Armitage mark came. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I, I came to Banjo mm -hmm. instead okay. to Krab Island. Uh, on the goal the four years course, mm -hmm. and then I left for uh, to become a, an unqualified teacher. Mm -hmm. I started teaching Bacau, mm -hmm. Bacau for one year, then sat for the college entrance examination into the college. When I was going, I became interested in the Kora again, and okay. I, I went along with it to the to the college, mm -hmm. which became very amazing mm -hmm. for everybody. Mm -hmm. And um, they said, well. Yeah, this is the man. Mm -hmm. um, how how can he make this possible mm -hmm. to 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 learn up to this stage and then be able back, to yeah, yeah. to play mm -hmm. on uh, our traditional mm -hmm. instruments? Mm -hmm. So that was it. In fact, that was what gave me the name very quickly. Okay. People were paying fares to come mm -hmm. to see whether actually the man we always hear on the radio. Is the one. Is the one. Is is a student. <laughs> yeah. So, so <coughs> speaking, okay. speaking of names, mm -hmm. is Jaliba your actual name? Mm -hmm. uh, this is not just a title. People <laughs> think it's a title. Yes. <laughs> it is not just a title. Mm -hmm. When I was born, mm -hmm. I was named after my great grandparent, mm -hmm. who was called Jaliba. Mm -hmm. You know why? Maybe I had another name, but <laughs> this was... Uh, the one that stuck. Uh, it was critically done by my father. Okay. My father uh, commented that he was told that he's going to have a son mm -hmm. who was the scribe. Mm -hmm. And this description just uh, caught me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, marked me. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think he decided to not to tell anybody mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what all the name he gave me. Okay. Mm -hmm. They told him that I was going to be a singer mm -hmm. worldwide mm -hmm. and I was going to be a name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think that was why he didn't give I, they had this believing that um, Marabos can do anything to yes. you yes. <laughs> using your name, <laughs> your own name, your father's <laughs> name or mother's name. I think that was the reason. Okay. That was the reason. So I was uh, caught up by the hand mm -hmm. to the classroom, mm -hmm. to the headmaster's office, mm -hmm. and uh, on the register it was written Jaliba Kuyate, and that's the name I know. People keep asking Actually. about. <laughs> <laughs> this because is the name I know. About. Because Jaliba is the term in Mandinka which means a, a great, big, a, a great, a great yeah. period. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So if if someone's name is to be the great, great. I mean, of course, people would think you have a name before, name before. that. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I always thought, you, you know, you had a name. Could this is just Ibrahim. your stage mm -hmm. name. Yeah. Well, uh, it became a problem for everybody, I think. <laughs> people kept asking, 
I think it was even uh, a question in some quiz competitions. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who knows Jalibar's real yeah. name? Everybody <laughs> knows. It was always a question. Um, well, that was how and that was why mm -hmm. the name Jaliva is just Jaliva. Mm -hmm. And I think I keep it at that. Mm -hmm. I don't know myself. Mm -hmm. yeah. One day, People kept asking me since when I was young. Mm -hmm. I went to my father and said, look, you have to tell me who I am. Mm -hmm. What is my name? Mm -hmm. My father just laughed. Mm -hmm. He said, okay, now I'll give you three names. Mm -hmm. If you can choose any one of them. <laughs> he yes. said, Ibrahim, <laughs> Muhammad, and Ismaila. Now go, choose. I'm going to choose so you. <laughs> still, I'm um, in that darkness. Uh, to date, I don't know. You don't know. You I just know, know you're Jaliba. Uh, yes. <laughs> That's it. Okay. <laughs> of course, it's a great name. Ibo, you have so, yes. Okay. The Kora. Where did you first play Kora music? Uh, you mean publicly? Yes, yes. publicly. Where yeah. was your first show? Mm -hmm. your first when show. was it? And why was it? Uh, I think this was in Jambanjeli. That was a small arena. Mm hmm um we started a program mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. with some of our friends there mm -hmm. okay then mrs sano and others were there mm -hmm. uh, i could remember they were paying 50 bututs oh. entrance fee <laughs> so <laughs> it was a long time very and um you know mm -hmm. i was just sitting on the mat and playing it was amazing to people because uh, the first compositions I did mm -hmm. were appealing to, si to society. And, well, they became interested. That was why people said, well, we can pay and, mm -hmm. and, and, and come, yeah, and, and, come and watch this man, okay. this did boy. You, did you mm -hmm. just play or you sang and play at the same time? Mm -hmm. I play mm -hmm. and sing at the same time. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is another style you have to be used to. Okay. Otherwise, if you play, mm -hmm. in some people, they don't have those qualities. Mm -hmm. When they play, they cannot sing. Mm -hmm. Or when they play, they'll just stop yes. temporarily mm -hmm. and then uh, start to talk or sing. Mm -hmm. But then you have to do it in unison. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have to get used to it. Mm -hmm. You have to practice it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, mm -hmm. you can't get used to it. And uh, I think even when, when you get used to it, it is very, very it's important. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's a query about, you know, when Jelwa came from Nyamina, mm -hmm. his first destination. Mm -hmm. Others were saying Suguta, Brikam, or others, Banjul. Where was it? Because they all want to own you. Yes. They all want to be like, oh, yes. yeah, he's from here, here you know, no, he's, yes. he's from Suguta. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, mm? and this is true. I'm from all these places. <laughs> <laughs> I had a feeling you would say that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> Honestly. You know That's very sweet. <laughs> yeah. You know, when I was in the college, mm -hmm. uh, there was this activity of uh, teachers going out on teaching practice. Okay. So I was posted to Sukuta. Mm -hmm. That was before Brikama. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was posted to Sukuta and I was in Jambakunda. Uh, yet I was still playing the kora. I became used to some people. In fact, my first wife. Okay. Um, that was that was the time I picked her up from Sukuta. Wow. Um, I w I, you know, uh, that short time, one or two months, I was a Sukutarian. <laughs> <laughs> Completely a secretary. So uh, after the after the teaching practice, mm -hmm. I was back in the college. Then I started going round, mm -hmm. playing for people outside. Mm -hmm. yeah, they were coming to get us every weekend from the college mm -hmm. to go and play mm -hmm. during their Christian ceremonies. Mm -hmm. I mean, in all these villages. Lament around. Mm -hmm. but I started in Lament too. Mm -hmm. Then I was working. There was no fare for us. <laughs> few of us. I know. Uh, we were walking on foot from the college. Then the Union College. Yeah. Walking Lamin. on foot to Lament. Wow. Play and then come back on foot. Food. Yes. Because amazing. we were not doing this for anything. Mm -hmm. Not for money. 
אז 